She looked back as bad. My mom's knocked out. You learn, my friends. How do I look? Crazy, right? Anyways, good morning. I mean, no, good afternoon. <laughs> so, it is currently... Sorry. I don't know if you guys can hear that. My neighbors are playing music upstairs. But, it is currently 5.23 on Saturday. I actually went to work this morning. And I came out. I got Chick-fil-A. And I knocked the fuck out. Because, honestly, I didn't want to do much today. Um, I was really tired. And... I just went to work and then I was like, mm, I don't want to do anything else. But, but there is a hurricane that is supposed to be hitting us tomorrow. So I figured that I would get everything that I need to get done today. So then tomorrow I can have like a pamper day. Um, which I'll probably be vlogging that too. But anyways, right now I'm about to head out because I am going to go to Starbucks. So I'm going to go to Starbucks and then I have to go to this Korean like market next to my house. Because I want to go and get these chips that I'm obsessed with. They're called, um, what are they called? Turtle chips or something like that. And the flavor Coco Chiro. Oh my god. Those shits are freaking bomb. So I'm going to do that. And then after that, I think I'm going to head to Ulta. Because I just came back from vacation. And I'm all out of my face wash. And um, my acne like an acne serum that I used to use. I used to use a Sunday Riley one. But I did find one. It's called, it's by the brand Derma E. So I'm going to go and pick one of those up. And then, honestly, I don't think I have anything else planned for the rest of the day. Bills, can you pay my telephone bill? Can you pay my automobile? Okay, sorry. That's what they're playing up there. Going to Starbucks. Hi, can I get a <laughs> can I get a venti um passion tango tea lemonade? Do you want that yes, please. Can I get it with uh, six pumps of liquid cane sugar? Uh, and can I get a water, an ice water? That's gonna be it. Thank you. Nice. Oh my god, I can't believe the line was so long. This line is always freaking packed. Like. Uh, Oh, this is the USA. I was gonna say, what? Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's see if they made it good. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. 10 out of 10. You made me. Okay, so I just got to the Korean um, market. I'm gonna get my, my little snack and then I'll go ahead and I'll probably show you guys when I get it um, what they look like. So I'll be back. I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I got these turtle chips and choco churros. These are so freaking good. I was about to cry when I went in because I didn't see them. They only had like four left. And when I came like two days ago, they had a whole bunch. So they go quick. That's why I bought two. And then I bought these mozzarella cheese and fish, fish sausage corn dog. I made those in my microwave oven so good 
Mm. Yeah. I buy those because the nearest one, the nearest place that sells those is Boston. And that's like half an hour away. That's too far. I'm not driving. At least not right now. Like, if I really want to try like really good authentic ones. I'll go ahead and make a trip to Boston. Probably like... I'll go soon. But not now. Okay, let's go ahead and let's listen to some music. So now, we're headed to Ulta. La capital completa, así mismo están los campos, le dan hasta campo. Para que tú quieres mi contacto, tú eres por el chote, el negro, el chivato, el chivato. Para que tú quieres mi contacto. Okay, guys, sorry for the bad video quality. I look weird. But I did just make my, what is it, this Korean corn dog? And I want to try it. Take two. I think now it's done. Mm. Cheese pool. Mm -hmm. It's like salty and sweet at the same time. Mm. Some ketchup. Mm. Mm. It's good. Mm. I made two. I I'm a bad vlogger. I am and I'm just like guys, I'm sorry, I look at the viewfinder a lot. It's not on purpose, but Nana Should be forcing it. Anyways, welcome back to my channel. So I already vlogged a little bit yesterday. Um, hold on. Let's wait until she decides that um, we can vlog. Okay. I can't. Okay. So it is Sunday, August 22nd, and it is almost 5 o'clock. Is this going to focus? It's not going to focus. Anyways, so I actually forgot to show you guys everything that I bought at Ulta yesterday. So I figured that I would do that right now. I spent a lot of money. <laughs> okay, anyways, let's go ahead and get into the little haul of everything that I bought yesterday. So I ran out of um, this cleanser. So this is La Roche. I don't know if I'm saying that right. But I love this cleanser. Literally, it has saved my life. Um, I ran out of it before I left to Puerto Rico. I used another cleanser. It was good. It was nice and hydrating. But... It just wasn't giving me what this was giving me. Um, and I have a little flare-ups, kind of. So, getting back to my OG cleanser. I love this shit. Then, I ran out of my UFO... Uh, what is it? My UFO drops from Sunday Riley. Which is, like, supposed to be my acne control um, drops. And I wanted to try out something different. So I ended up finding this online. It's called the Derma E Acne Blemish Control Treatment Serum. 
and it has salicylic acid which i'm pretty sure is what my ufo drops also had so this is what i bought see. i haven't used it yet <clears throat> but let me see oh it's it's definitely different from what i had previously bought this is definitely the other one was more of an oil this one is definitely more of a serum but it is nice and feels nice and hydrating and just really nice i'm excited to try this then i actually shattered my last bottle of this so i bought a hyaluronic acid we're trying to have a nice youthful plumpy skin you know bring hydration to the skin so then i bought these pure gel under eye like what is it like gel eye patches or gel i don't know but they're like these little things that go under the eyes i'm really excited to try these because ever since i came back from puerto rico my under eyes are not doing that great so i bought this lip pencil my favorite lip pencil um this is the ColourPop lip pencil and bff3 if you're looking for a really nice brown lip liner 10 out of 10 would recommend this lip liner oh my god look you can kind of see hold on look at that it's like a true brown it just makes your lips look really nice and if you like overlining your lips which i like overlining my lips it's perfect it's literally perfect and it's really creamy um so this is 100 percent pure haitian castor oil and it is in rosemary mint so i picked this up it was 20 bucks i've never used this i usually just get regular jamaican black castor oil for my hair and i buy it at the beauty supply and then i mix it with um with coconut oil but i think this might be a little bit easier and i'll see if i like it better if i get better results with this then i bought my best friend swears by this stuff and i kind of i'm actually let me put some on right now actually okay let me tell you what it is first so i got this clarence paris it's a lip comfort oil in the it's in raspberry mm, it smells really good and it's really hydrating look at that with just one i didn't have to dip back in mm, 10 out of 10 i like it you know what this kind of reminds me of like the pack not 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 mm, the packaging maybe a little bit the packaging but the the little spoolie inside it kind of reminds me of the the dior one and it's way cheaper than the dior one then i actually found this and i bought it even though it's just really expensive but i'm really excited to try it with some makeup so it's the plump and prime luxury face primer by too faced guys this shit is like exquisite like look at this packaging like it just looks expensive because it is fucking expensive this shit was like 42 dollars i don't think i've ever spent that much in a primer ever in my life and then the last thing that i actually ended up getting i have no idea where i put it i ended up getting the ariana grande cloud um perfume but I got like the little the little version. It was like $24. Yep, that's all I bought at Ulta. I think now I'm going to go ahead and put on this like hair oil. My camera's dying. What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Yeah, I'm going to put on this hair oil now. Oh. Hey, you guys. Just so, um, I am... A fail like a really big fail anyways guys I am a total fail um, my camera died earlier so I went ahead and I already did like my hair mask I had it on all day so I just finished taking a shower and I put a little bit of this this L'Oreal no hair cut cream this thing it smells so good and it leaves my hair nice and like silky and stuff but I don't think it's the best it's l'oreal anyways but it's it, my hair does feel really nice when i put it on and it leaves my hair just nice and like really good but probably just a whole bunch of silicones and stuff so i am going to do my skincare right now guys i didn't do anything i didn't end up uh hold on 
putting on my lip oil. Yeah, guys, so I didn't end up doing everything that I wanted to. I started washing my clothes, but I didn't finish. I started cleaning my room, but I didn't finish. Uh, I didn't take off, like, my hairs. Uh, so I'm gonna have to do that. <coughs> Probably later. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my skincare now. I was watching some Maggie McDonald. I freaking love her. She's from Boston. I love watching her vlogs. So I'm just gonna do that and then yeah, I'm just gonna do my skincare and then I'm probably just gonna watch more vlogs and then I'm just probably gonna go to sleep, honestly, because I have work tomorrow. Um so I'm gonna do a little montage of me doing my skincare and then I'll talk to you guys later. That feels so good. Honestly, the last step, you guys can honestly skip it. I personally like just putting this on because it just makes my face feel so nice and like hydrated and like, oh, it just adds a nice like, it just feels refreshing and like, oh, it just feels really good. Like, it gives me spa vibes. I'm gonna put a little bit more of this on, but this step, honestly, you guys don't need it everything else i it's a new routine that i'm trying because i'm out of a lot of the my original like skincare stuff honestly my skincare is kind of all over the place i kind of just do what i feel like my skin needs at that moment i don't have like a specific routine that i use um only during the day i do have more of a specific routine like cleanser um SPF and then moisturizer and then if I feel like I need a little bit more of a pick-me-up then I'll use a hyaluronic acid in the morning but um, This is new This is new This I Use here and there. This is when I feel like my skin is really really dry and just I need a little bit more of something more hydrating I guess um, it's more of a repair bomb it's not actually a moisturizer I did see a lot of people using this on TikTok when they do their makeup and it makes their makeup look really glowy and stuff like that so I figured if people are using it for that purpose I can use it as a moisturizer like at night if I need a little bit of a pick-me-up and my skin just needs it so I did that but oh I found my UFO drops look at how much I have left hold on can you see? Psst, uh, nothing. I have like a little, little tiny bit at the bottom. But, yep. Oh, guys. And I ended up finding the perfume, the Ariana Grande Cloud. It was in my makeup stuff. But, yep. Guys, I am so sorry if this vlog ended up being really boring. Um, I am not a good vlogger. I'm probably gonna have to like continue this vlog. I was supposed to vlog all day today and I honestly just like didn't do anything um, because I'm a procrastinator. So I don't know if I'm gonna try to continue the vlog like throughout the week, just add a couple more clips in here or if I'm gonna end the vlog here. If I do end up ending the vlog here, uh, it was nice seeing you guys again. Ooh.